back and forth we have gone. Rangers won the opener this series fairly convincingly on Friday. Yesterday it was the Astros with a late flurry to win it uh, by a convincing score as well. And so now today we'll see what transpires between these two clubs. I mean at 279 for the year. Chaz gets to test that hamstring early on and calls off Jordan Alvarez. Chaz missed the last three games with that hamstring injury. But back in center field today. Was the change up and it dropped below the zone. So Seeger draws a walk with one out. Here's Evan Carter. Got him. Yeah, just can't cover both. You can't. Because that's a pitch that people at home see 92 right. down the middle of the plate. But it's the changeup in the hitter's count that messes you up. Let's see what Javi chooses here. One, two on Garcia. Gets him swinging with that elevated yeah. fastball. Christian Javier picking up a couple of strikeouts in the inning. And we head to the bottom of the first. Yeah, Nabaldi's got everything. He's got fastball, sinker, <clears throat> slider, curve, and split. But the biggest thing about Nathan is he is one of the competitors in the game. You got to bring your lunch lunchbox to this game when you come and face him. He's ahead of Altuve 0 and 2, and Altuve drills one. If it doesn't hook, it's a home run, and it is a home run. Altuve, number six in his career against Nabaldi. He doesn't have more than three against any other pitcher, but he's got six against the right-hander from <laughs> Alvin. Well, I tell you what, when I talked about Evaldi, you're also talking to a, a potential Hall of Famer right here that he's facing in the box who doesn't quit either. So his swing has been great lately. He's been, we talked about a little bit last night, he's getting his foot down and he's square and stayed on that heater and just destroyed it. Josh Smith leads it off, left-handed hitting third baseman. Smith puts this one in play. Jordan Alvarez getting another shot in left field. We'll put this one away for the first out. And this ball hit high in the air to center field. Chaz McCormick under it. Two fly ball outs here in the second inning. Jonah Heim the batter. And he does get a lot of swings under the baseball. He and here we see three fly ball outs in the second inning. One, two, <laughs> three innings for Christian Javier. Jeremy Pena to get it started here for the Astros. One, two, and he strikes out swinging. Good job by Evaldi, his first strikeout of the ball game. Great splitter right there from Nathan Evaldi. The splitter comes in at 91 miles an hour, but look at how it just drops out of the zone. Evaldi with 49 swings and misses so far this season. That's third most in the American League. And that looked good. Strike three called. Back-to-back -back strikeouts. And this time Nathan gets it done with the curveball. Caratini unable to pull the trigger right here. So two gone, bases empty for Abreu. Then he bounces it over to first. Duran will take it to the bag himself. And so Evaldi comes back for a real nice and tidy second inning. It's still one nothing. Duran, he's playing first base today, holds the bat high. Dubon's making his second Astro start at third and makes that play smoothly for the first out. Score that five to three, and there's one away for Tavares. Strike three called. Yeah. Emil Jimenez punches out Leody Tavares, who took that fastball in the corner for the third strikeout for Javier, second out of the inning. Ground balls towards third, two hops for Dubon. He has got an arm over there. One, two, three inning for Christian Javier. A couple of ground outs and a strikeout. He has looked good through three. Astros lead one nothing. Bottom of the third inning, the ninth place hitter is Mauricio Dubon. Now, and first pitch bounced up the middle. Good backhand semi to throw to first. In time, nice stretch by Duran. And they get Dubon one away. Here's Altuve. Ripped one to left field on an 0-2 pitch his last time up for a homer, his fourth of the year. Altuve oh got him again. Number seven against Evaldi. Unbelievable. Two swings, two bombs, two-nothing Astros. A 3-0 home run for Altuve. Because swinging all day long on 3-0. You had some pretty good numbers, 3-0. Yeah. He's feeling it right now. Okay, three innings in the books. And now the Rangers on the attack here against Javier. Seeger hits one high in the air out to center. Karmic to his right. One pitch, one out. He brings up Evan Carter. The Rangers hitless so far. The one base runner they had, a Seeger, via the walk in the first inning. This ball hit hard out to right. Tucker hardly runs after it. It's gone. Evan Carter's second home run of the year. And now the Rangers are on the board. It's two to one. Well, in his first at bat, Javier went right after Evan Carter and threw a fastball. 
right down the middle past a swinging Evan Carter. But he evens things up right here. McCormick grounded out his last time up. Chaz hits one to left field. He's got some top spin, and it's going to be a fair ball. And he's going to hold up at second base. Well played out there by Evan Carter. But good base running, too, because he was running himself into an out if he kept going. Now Jeremy Pena goes the other way. No. McCormick's thinking first to third. He puts the brakes on, though. He was trying to pick up Gary Pettis there as he was thinking about going first to third, and Pettis said probably better not to challenge Adolis Garcia. And the Astros have business here in the fourth inning with nobody out. Lefty Caratini at the plate. Switch hitting catcher for the Astros. Look at this. Ground ball. Look at this. Fair ball. That's going to score a run. Here comes McCormick crossing the plate. Pena to third. Caratini will be safe at second base. RBI double. 3-1 Astros. That'll bring up Dubon. Is a big at bat right here, taking advantage of the Rangers. Good offensive team. You can't let these opportunities go to waste. Into right Somebody field, out. Garcia on the move. He can't get there. In comes Pena. Caratini being waved home. Here comes the throw. It's going to be wide. Two RBI base hit Dubon. Astros up five to one. That's called staying inside the ball and hitting the ball over the other way. Exactly That's how you be so good about it. Exactly how you described it. Now it's Leody Tavares struck out looking his first time up. And that's out to the alley in left field. That gets down. And it'll be up to McCormick to track it down for the Astros, but not before Tavares has a stand-up double. Now it's Marcus Simeon, 0 for 2. Fly out and a ground out today. And he hits that ball hard down into that left field corner. Tavares will score easily. Marcus can cruise to second with the RBI double. His fifth double of the year, and it's 5-2. to two. There are two away. Diaz still at first for Jeremy Pena. And he hits it down to third and just inside the line. That'll be extra bases. Diaz to third. They wave him, and the relay throw on the way. He is out at the plate. A perfect peg from Seeger, and they gun down Diaz. To win the inning. Perfect one hopper to Jonah High to complete the play. Back to back walks after the single. So the bases will remain loaded with one out. And he hits the ball down double. the line and left. Oh. It's hooking. It's a fair ball. Jordan scores. Tucker scores. Yiner Diaz being held up. A two RBI double for the Chaz Manian Devil. And the Astros <laughs> lead it 7 2. What, Chaz? Ground ball right side, diving stop, Simeon, no chance to get the runner at second, gets Caratini at first. That'll be an RBI ground out, and the Astros add to their lead. It's now 8-2. to two. All right, back-to-back -back singles to start the ninth. Final hope for the Rangers is Marcus Simeon. He had an RBI double in the fifth. And he hits one a ton in the air. Deep out to left, it is gone! Three-run homer for Marcus Simeon, and the Rangers do cash in in the ninth inning. Joe Spada not taking any chances with a three-run game here. Nobody on base. He is bringing in his closer, Josh Hader, to face Corey Seager. And he gets him again. Ball game over. Astros win it 8-5. to Back-to-back -back wins for the Houston Astros. And bagging out's a nice series win after dropping that first game 12-8.